Hello and welcome, this is Majin Metroid, or Sir Steven, and this is Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII Part Eleven. Got a little mixed up on my numbering last time, but this is Part Eleven, and here we are with Laguna and the boys. <sighs> Alright, I'm there. Is this a dream? So, doing pretty, I think I finally got the audio problems worked out, this will be my final test, and if this one doesn't turn out right, then I've got to take drastic actions, change the way I record completely, I don't know, but I think it's going to work, I've tested it like five or six times, and just as long as I speak loud, speak loud enough, I'll be able to talk over the music. Oh, there's Julia, uh, Ranella's mother. That's Laguna Squall's father. As we all know, because we're all super huge Final Fantasy VIII fans. I mean, what other reason would you be watching this video? There's no one watching this video. You're talking to ghosts. Ah! Cramping up in his leg. I used to get little Charlie horses and shit. When yet when that happens, when you get a, when your foot cramps up, the best thing you can do is just make a 90 degree angle with your foot, and uh, maybe even stand up and step on it. That'll get rid of the cramp. Just and then, then stretch it out a little bit carefully, not careful not to get the cramp going again. You know, just that's how I do it. I'm used to anyway. I don't it hasn't happened to me in a long time. Good work, Laguna. Sure. Negative three on the manliness scale. I think he's got balls if he can even go up there and approach her. What are these other two schmoes doing? They're just sitting here. They're not drinking anything. They're just sitting here in a bar making fun of a guy for trying to, you know, put, get a little love in his life. You know, he just wants to, he just wants someone to share his life with. And, these, and his br and his chums are giving him a hard time about it. It's messed up. My leg is broken. Leave me be. You don't understand. My leg is broken. Leave me be. Good old Saturday Night Live clip. Keenan Thompson. Scarlett Johansson. It was a good episode. I went through a phase where I was watching every episode of SNL, and I made it from the first season Will Ferrell's in all the way to season like 40, 39 or 40. It was like it's over 20 seasons, I think, and uh, it was good times. Saturday Night Live is, you know, it's a pillar of comedy. It's where a lot of great comedians get their start. I always dreamed I would be on that show one day, like, you know, like, I've always wanted to say, live from New York, it's Saturday night! I guess I just did, but, it's not the same. Maybe that's how I'll start my Let's Plays. Live from my bedroom, it's Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII! Alright, now we gotta go meet her in her bedroom. 
talk about things. Just gotta save compulsively, which is Julia's room. Invite me, baby. It's Julia, I believe you're trying to seduce me. says I love eyes on me and if you haven't heard the Megadeth version you are missing out search YouTube for eyes on me Megadeth cover it is it's it takes a nice beautiful love song and it turns it into something pretty intense something unexpected I would say but uh, it's pretty cool Megadeth eyes on me A hard, it's like a hard metal rock version of the song. And there's a guy singing it, and the lyrics kind of, the meaning kind of changes as he sings. Compared to the original song. to me. Oh, tender, tender moments in the Final Fantasy VIII game. You gotta ship out, and that was the end. Lovers torn apart. Was a part of broken into two, two, two. Feeling that it's gone. Take care of my love. Miss you love. Someday love will find you. Break those chains that burn you. One night will remind you. Always I'd stand with our separate ways. If he ever hurts you, true love won't desert you. You know I still love you. I'd touch down with our separate ways. I love Journey. Way back to the game. Sorry about that. I think my singing must be terrible, but uh, I love it. You know, I think you should try it too. If you're in the shower, turn on the radio and sing along. You will feel amazing if you really put your heart into it. Even if you te even if you sound terrible, just like it releases endorphins and shit in your system, it releases feel good energy in your body, positivity. Trust me.
Should be there soon, eh? Yep, here we go. Still sleepy. Come on, Toby. Tobias. Timber, here we are. Okay, what was the password? But the owls are still around, yes. Bingo! We got the password, we got the power. Alright, I'm gonna play this lady in cards. Uh, should we play, should we mix rules? Sure, what's your rule? Same? Okay. You can't get away with not having the same rule. So you do want to mix rules so that open is in play. Because you really want to see what your opponent has. That's like top priority. Shouldn't be. Oh, I. Fucking up. Fucking up, Majin Metroid. And we did it! Woo! Deathclaw, sure. Alright, I don't know, I just read somewhere that that guy's got good, or that woman has good cards. Well, not great cards, but uh, better cards, but it doesn't really seem that way. Alright, coming up we can get the old Angelo card. It's probably the crappiest of the best cards. Should be good. Yeah, we're seed. I'm a squad leader to buy us. This is Alan Selfie. Sorry to jet, but I'm in a hurry. Ooh, dissed. Getting dissed by Squall. Squall don't shake hands, man. It's like Howie Mandel. He's got... He fears germs. That's what Squall is dealing That's why he's so... That's why he's so quiet. He doesn't want to pass on his own germs to other people. And he certainly doesn't want to get germs from other people. So that is why he's a dick all the time and keeps to himself. They're probably going to get Howie Mandel to play Squall next time... When they remake Final Fantasy VIII. That's what I'm thinking. You would do great. You do a great job. Oh man, does anybody remember the commercial for Gopher Cakes? It wasn't well. It wasn't a commercial for Gopher Cakes, but it was a commercial promoting eating healthy and not eating like ding-dongs and ho-hos, but they had this big commercial in it, and um, I had these kids eating these gopher cakes, which are basically like ding-dongs. It's like, go for, go for gopher cakes. Okay, and I want to, before this episode's over, I'd like to attempt getting the Angelo card. And he hasn't played it, of course, because they never play cards I want them to play.
K winning. Yes, one more game and then we'll. Doesn't show up that time. Doesn't show up in the next game. We'll just do it in the next episode. Good. The open rule spread. That's good. And he hasn't played it. So that's the end of this episode. I will catch you in the next one. Uh, where, I, where I will have won this card off screen. And we will meet Renoa for the first time. We'll figure out what we're going to name him. Because we named Squall Tobias. We can't name Renoa Renoa. We need to be consistent with our non-conforming -con names. So see you next time. This is Majin Metroid or Sir Steven. Follow me at Sir Steven. That's S-E-R Steven at S-E-R Steven on Twitter. Goodbye and thanks for watching.